Charles County. Good morning, my friend. Good morning. So I know, I, I know I'm not the only one on this set, right? That we go into schools, we're kind of floored with how bright students are, just the advanced classes they're taking. But, you know, this story, that's only kind of half of the equation. Not only bright, but extremely compassionate. Seeing a need in their school and then finding a solution. Zach Blakemore is a junior at Timberland High School in the Wentzville District. He's overcome a lot in his young life. He has a disease similar to spastic cerebral palsy. He doesn't walk or talk, but that hasn't stopped him from being one popular guy at school. I actually know him from elementary school, and he's pretty popular around the community, I would say. So when these four seniors heard about a challenge Zach was facing, they set out to find a solution. He's a sweet kid, so it's good to do something nice for him. After asking for ideas for a class project, they learned about the lengthy process for Zach to put on a jacket. Every single morning we wake him up, if he needs a jacket, we need, know we need to plan an extra 10 minutes or so just to get a jacket on. You can see we have attachments here. And so it's this group big. decided to create the Zacket. They spent weeks designing and sewing a specialized jacket that their classmate could put on much quicker. The Zacket has Velcro straps that his caretakers can easily use. And it's complete with a Captain America patch. We want to make it special to him, so we figured that we should put that little extra touch for him. And for Zach's mom, it truly is special, the jacket and what it represents. As a mom, one of the things most important to me is that people see past Zach's wheelchair, that he's a kid just like they are, and I think these kids demonstrated that the very best that I've seen it done. They realized that with simple adaptations, Zach can be just like every other kid. Wow, yeah, isn't that great? Wow. All right, so the four students in this bio, um, biomedical innovations class, they want to apply for a patent for their jacket, and then the ultimate goal would actually be uh, doing a design for, for toddlers in car seats, because you talk about all the time, right? you can't right. put a puppy jacket on a toddler and put them in a car seat, so they want to kind of, you know, maybe go that route as well, so. Gosh. It's amazing, and, and the fact that they're that smart to come up with something yeah. is great, but the compassion of the children mm -hmm. for their classmates, mm -hmm. that makes it all the more special. Had mom in tears. Yeah. Had me in tears. Yeah. How impressive, Ryan. Wow. Thanks for that. Thanks, Ryan. Hey, if you know anyone